When I say the word math, what immediately springs to mind? Does it make you go, oh no, complicated formulas, algebra? No, thank you. We know that for many children, learning maths can be a daunting process. With so many new concepts and numbers and methods to learn, it can be really hard to think, what am I doing in school and, and how is it ever going to relate to my real life? Maths is all around us. When we go to the supermarket, when we're driving in our car, when we're cooking, even when we're looking at the shapes in flowers and shells and paintings, maths is all about patterns and maths is all around us. Today is International Maths Day and we want to celebrate the maths in our everyday lives. Today, we're gonna to be looking at four different areas. We're gonna be looking at maths of us, thinking about the numbers that are important in our lives, how old we are, how tall we are, what number house we live at, when our birthday is. We're gonna be thinking about the maths all around us and thinking about how we organize time, the shapes in our environment, thinking about the maths that we use when we're traveling. We're also gonna be looking at maths in stories and maths in history. Do you know that fractions were invented by the ancient Egyptians? They used to pay their workers in bread. And sometimes if you had nine workers and eight loaves of bread, you had to share them using fractions. We're also gonna be looking at maths in arts and crafts and seeing if we can create 3D pictures. We're also gonna be looking at some of the maths figures in the past and present that are working hard to make maths a fun subject for all. But the learning doesn't stop there. We would like you to take part in our Maths Home Challenge. Have a look at the maths in your home, in your streets. See if you can find anything, any number signs to look at. Take a selfie of what you found out and share it with us. Also, there's a great website called Maths on Toast where there's loads of fun games that you can take part in at home. There's number stories you can share, there's instructions to how to create mathematical art pieces, and also some activities you can look at that involve engineering. Whatever you do, take a picture and send it in to us by the 22nd of March. There may be some prizes for the best winners. Remember, the golden rule of maths is just have fun. Don't be too hard on yourself if you get it wrong. That is all part of the learning process.